Because cold water actually gives you a sore throat. No, it's a lie. First of all, you need to know that coughs and sore throats are actually caused by viruses and germs. So when you drink cold water, it does not introduce any germ at all. The only thing that cold water does is that it can trigger a vasoconstriction, meaning that the blood vessels in your throat tightens and your muscles contract slightly. Once this happens, your throat can feel irritated or stiff, but this is temporary. It is not an infection. But now I'll be explaining every single thing to you now. Now let's go deeper. People with mild asthma, cold water or any icy drink is not advisable because the reaction is that your throat and your airway muscles tighten slightly and before you know you start coughing your chest feel tightened and you start having issues with your breathing so just room temperature or slightly cold water is okay now for people with severe asthma your airways are very reactive and they are easily irritated that just a small sip of cold water could be dangerous if cold water or cold drinks touches your throat your breathing tubes muscles they tighten so much and get very narrow that air won't be able to easily pass through and the mucus in your lungs which are meant to trap jam and dust and are supposed to be thin they will now start getting thick and which could affect your breathing and increases the risk of bacteria and viruses infection which can result into cough wheeze or chest tightness so please entirely avoid cold drinks or cold water and stick to warm water now for people with chronic tonsil irritation or sore throat if you take cold water or cold drinks, you will reduce the flow of blood to your throat area and the implication of this is that your healing will be slow. That means your sore throat that's supposed to heal quickly will begin to get slow in healing. Even your mucus can thicken and we already know that thick mucus can increase the risk of bacteria and viruses infection. So you will start noticing scratchy or irritated throat. Your throat will start scratching you. You will begin to feel pains in your throat. So please avoid icy drinks and warm water is okay. Also always stay hydrated to protect your throat. But please make sure you drink water when you're drinking it. Drink it slow. Lastly, for healthy people with no asthma or throat problems, usually nothing is harmful because your healthy throat and airways can handle it. Though sometimes cold drinks or cold water could cause temporary throat tightness, but that's just for a few minutes because it's just a temporary vasoconstriction. So cold water is fine once you moderately drink it. But after exercises or when your throat has been dry, when you want to take cold water, it's more advisable to first start with drinking warm water to calm your throat before taking cold water or cold drinks. So now what are the things you should have learned number one cold water does not carry any jam so it cannot cause any infection or sore throat directly number two it's not advisable for people with sensitive issues like asthma chronic throat and individuals with sore throats already number three room temperature or slightly warm water is okay for people with sensitive issues with their throat i hope you are well educated if you want more public health awareness education video like this please follow this page